Hey there, everybody. Welcome back to another episode in Crash Course in Clash of Clans. What is going on, everybody? And welcome back to our Let's Play series that we call here Crash Course in Clash of Clans, where you guys join me in a essentially a walkthrough of everything Clash of Clans from Town Hall 1 and 2 all the way up to hopefully the max Town Hall if we ever get there as a completely free-to-play player. Um, first things first that we typically do since it's been a couple days since I have recorded the last one, I'm going to clean up my base just a touch um, for you guys to get some of the gems, and we're going to cut back to it right after that. Cool? Cool. So we got the base dog clean up. We are now at 822 gems, 864 trophies. Let's go ahead and dive into some upgrades really quickly here. Um, as I said last time, we're going to change the format a little bit from upgrade attack upgrade attack to a couple sets of upgrades and attack a couple sets of upgrades attack um so that way we can get a lot more done in some of these videos um because the attacks are going to get repetitive pretty quickly although i will start to kind of open up some more options one of the first things i'm going to do is i'm going to actually upgrade the dark barracks the reason i'm upgrading the dark barracks is because the golem at the level four dark barrack is actually what i really really want um what going to be one of the more important troops for the next couple of town halls the bomb tower one of the things we upgraded last time is max level now that's awesome we absolutely love to see that cannot upgrade our clan castle you also notice our king went up to level six we're going to put him down again get him going to the next level really quick we'll collect some of that um and as you guys did see our season banks did come out which is always really nice um and you know what that means we can actually go over to our um, progress base and dump a little bit of loot especially into like our walls um that's going to be really nice for us let's do that let's actually see before we burn too much elixir um doo -doo 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 -doo. balloons those are something we'll use pretty constantly so those are definitely a nice thing to burn through and man this is what the free pass itself can do for you at least it's such an early town hall um, that's absolutely absurd how much progress that can give me. Look at all those walls now being done. Um, so we got that going. We had Nope, not that. We have our dark barracks going. And we want to start doing some other things and start catching them up a little bit. So we'll do something like that mortar, which will take a little bit of time. And we will also do the wizard tower. That makes some of the most sense to me. Um... That way the Wizard Tower and the King will all get done right around the same time. Not exactly, but close to. And man, I, are, I love the look of these walls already so much. Man, these are some of my absolute favorite looking ones. Um, those are pretty sweet. So we will come back when those upgrades are done. Cool? Cool. Alright, back from the couple upgrades. Go back over here. So, we got the Wizard Tower done, we got the Dark Barracks done, and I really wanted to get another level on that. Man, am I a little sad. I don't think I'll be able to. Oh, will I? Oh, we're definitely doing that. Um, that will unlock us the Golem, which is something we are going to use a ton, a ton, a ton. Um, going further ahead, right? Uh, so we'll do that. Let's take a look. That wizard tower still needs another level. Because, yeah, it's level behind the rest of those. And these guys can go up two levels at this uh, at this town hall. So we'll put down one more on that. We will do... And um, we will do another one of the... We'll do the archer tower again. Because that'll be a relatively quick upgrade. Um, man, and as I'm recording this part, right... Um, town hall 16 has been announced. And they have announced some changes. The king will actually go to level 20 at um at town hall eight um is what's the current theory going i don't know if it's confirmed or not um but that means we will stay at town hall eight probably a touch longer um just in order to get that done um and what's something else we can do right should we do the air defenses that's a pretty important defense air sweeper i actually think the air sweeper is a little more important so we're actually gonna do the air sweeper and now we're going to go into a raid. Cool? Let's go. So here is our replay we're going over. We're basically attacking a new Town Hall 7. Um, and the reason I'm showing this one is because, man, this was just a cute little design. It's it's a heart, and it's a heart inside of a heart at a Town Hall 7, which I think is adorable. I also picked this one because this is an attack I did um, on my computer. On a lot of these, even though I'm recording on my computer, um, I do end up making the attacks on my phone and going in and watching the replays. 
I'm on the computer for you guys, but this is one I actually did. Um, and you can see by how I placed the Giants and how I struggled to place the Wizards following up behind them. Uh, but it made the spell, uh, the spells a little bit more precise. I was able to kind of place them more so exactly how I wanted to, which was nice. But this wasn't a hard base by any means. Um, same thing, Giants, Hog Raiders, Giants, Wizards, and the Barbarian King on the bottom end here around 4 or 5 o'clock. Um, hogs come in closer to 8 or 9. I actually swagged a Poison Spell all the way over here, you guys can see. Um, and that made it just really easy. I swagged the Poison Spell because it bothers me. Um, to have stuff left over like that from attack ever since it doesn't cost anything um, in Clash of Clans anymore. So, run through the rest of the attack, super easy, perfect, three star, as easy as it gets. Let's go back to some more upgrades. Cool. So, we finished that raid. We're back here for a brief moment. Um, that Archer Tower is done. I actually, I'm going to do something that's going to make a lot of people annoyed. And I'm not sorry. I want to show you guys a different attack from what you've been seeing. We are going to book of everything. The Dark Barracks, which a lot of people, like I said, are not going to be a fan of. We're going to get rid of the Giants in favor of Golems. And uh, we're going to put down a couple more things really quickly, too. Um... We will do another level on the Archer Tower. I do believe the Tesla needs one more level to catch up to the other ones. So we will do that. Then we will come back when a couple of these things are done. Sweet. Sweet. Cool. So we are here again, taking a look after our Archer Tower, our Tesla, and our Wizard Tower are done again. We still do have a couple hours on the Sweeper, but we are going to come back to that later. Got a couple training potions. We're going to get 20 gems for those. A Clock Tower potion, which we basically don't use. Um, and we're back here with three builders. Now let's see, well, we're going to put down the Arch Tower again because we just kind of want to consistently keep that going up with the rest of our um, troops. Not troops. Um, stop clicking on that. Let me collect my loot cart. Um, we'll collect that. I don't have enough elixir to upgrade the Barb King. Do I have enough to upgrade my golems? I do. I'm going to upgrade the golems. Um... Because, like I said, we're going to use those for a couple levels, right? Those will be something that will be kind of higher on a priority list, right? Um, I got a ton of money in here that I don't necessarily need. Um, and I got stuff in the way. Wow. So let's do this. Um, tons of money. Do something like those. But those only have one level. Our wizard towers have two levels, I believe. But they're not nearly as expensive. What's the most expensive thing right now? Oh, Dark Spell Factory can go again. Um, oh, it can. Yeah, so we'll do that. We'll do a Dark Spell Factory. Um, and what else can we do? Our Barracks can go up another level. Our Dark Elixir Storage can go up another level. Oh, the Dark Elixir Storage is, is almost an absolute must. Um, so we're going to do those two. And um, I don't know if I just did a raid or if I just did some upgrades. So we're going to go accordingly. We'll be right back. Fade over. Welcome back, everybody. Um, I know I said normally we're going to do a couple sets of upgrades and then go into an attack. I know there's going to be an extra set of upgrades for you guys. It has been a couple of days since I last recorded, and I had to, had to, had to get on and do this. The new update just come out. Town Hall 16 just releases. I'm recording this right now. Oh, man, and I could not wait to put down the blacksmith. I am so excited for this. I think it's going to be so cool. Um, and I want to do that here with you guys, right? Most importantly. Um, so we're going to put down the blacksmith in our upgrade. We're going to come back over here. I'm going to be a little bit more hesitant to upgrade the barbarians and the archers since my archer queen and barbarian queen won't necessarily start spawning um, some of those guys. So I'm going to be a little bit more hesitant with that. Um... There's nothing left. Oh, that makes sense. We'll be right back. That was weird. New update, though, so game going to be a little glitchy, right? It does happen. Um, so let's do some more upgrades really quick. I wanted to go ahead and get a couple more out of the way. Um, let's look at our lab first, see if there's anything we can really upgrade here. Nothing great that I'm really a fan of. Let's actually go buy some Dark Elixir. 
Um, and we're actually going to do this to upgrade the hog. Um, our time here at Town Hall 8 might be a little longer because I do believe they also increased the level that you can make your Barbarian King. So we're actually going to upgrade him at the same time. Um, do, 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 do. I know I started working on some of these wizard towers. That's what I was talking about doing, at least. I don't know if I actually ended up doing that. Like I said, it has been a couple days. Uh, I know that Archer Tower was playing catch-up. Put the Archer Tower down. Uh, my cat hates the couch behind me, oh, apparently. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Storages don't need anything like that. Uh, I still do have a couple of really low-level storages. We're going to have to come back into those in the next level. Oh, we got to do the morgue. Let's do the morgue. We'll start catching that up. Now we'll go into a raid, and we'll come back for one last set of upgrades. Cool? Cool. All right, so I'm trying to take the headset off, Kyle. I'm trying out with level one golems. Um, we're gonna see how this goes. I don't, I don't know how this is gonna go because I only have two of them. Normally, I try and have more. Um, we'll just see. Throw down the golems here, and I'm doing this one live. I don't normally do live raids with you guys, um, but this is the first one I'm doing that will probably one of the only one too that I'm doing that will actually be live. Um, but I want you guys to see me trying to do this on the computer and how much easier and or harder it is. Um, let's put the haste there to kind of push him through a little bit more. We got a golem down on the bottom, which is not where we want him to be. Uh, heal down there to help get rid of that wizard tower a little bit quicker. We did get a couple hogs split off. Um, but we do have a free spell, or not a free spell, we have a Christ Kyle. We do have a heal spell for the very last wizard tower. Super easy. We can swag the poison. And my hogs will clean up the rest of this base. This is a good feeling. It feels nicer with the golems. They can tank a little bit more. I don't need to really worry about them. Look, I mean, there's still, run there's still two golemites and the golem itself running around. Thankfully, this base was very compact, so I got a lot of value out of the hogs. But this is essentially the attack we'll be using for Town Hall 8 and Town Hall 9. And maybe even Town Hall 10 if I can get it to work. I used to be able to use it really well at Town Hall 10. Um, but probably can't anymore. Um, and man, is it hard to do the raids with the mouse. This is about as complex as a raid could probably get for me. Um, actually playing on the PC. I think something like my Super Archer Blimps on Town Hall 15 would be annihilated. But super easy raid more upgrades now cool so we got our mortar and our archer tower upgraded we have our blacksmith now unlocked oh dude that's gonna be so sweet actually gonna be able to use this we now have earthquake boots um for our king and our king can now go to level 20 um can i actually upgrade this no i cannot at town hall 8 okay i believe you just unlock it at town hall 8. you actually don't get it at town hall 7 um so that makes a lot of sense so, here's what we're going to do. We're going to get one more set of upgrades. Ooh, Clan War Wealth. Look at all. We got some gems. Let's go 100 gems. Wow. Um, let's set down our dragons. 2 million elixir. No big deal. Let's put down the other archer tower. Let's put down the mortar again. Just to play catch up with those couple things. Um, get those all kind of on that same spot. Let's see what else. Uh, that's already done still. 700 for one of the wizard towers. I'll tell you what, I do want to get one of those going. Um, oh man, should I just send on both of them? F it, we've all. Um, we're going to send on both of those, and we're going to start... Um, nothing else, right? That's that, that. Yeah, that's everything, so that's awesome. So that's going to cut it for this episode. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I do appreciate it. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what other kind of content you guys want to see, and I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks, everybody.